this is all. Oh, we out here with Trinity's finest. Got a big game this week, South Lake. Hey, this is what we do to keep them uh, ready to go. We call this in-season training. What happens really is it's called rehab. Samar tore up his groin. Probably wouldn't be able to play this week if I didn't have my magic hands. Keep the kids ready. Hey, all you that are hurting right now, you probably should come in and get this word. What time is it? Let's see what we got, Coach. What 8 30. Yep. We stay working. We stay open. The reason we stay open is I wish I had this as a kid when I was in high school. But that's what we do. Just giving back, man. Man givers. Men givers. Men givers. So we got Samara Morton right here. Her growing. Safety extraordinaire. We got Brandon Diaz, the city's finest, talking about this boy. He lucky I made him into a running back. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't a running back before. You weren't a running back before you came here, son. They're calling themselves Dragon Slayers this week. We'll see, though. Rehab this ACL. We got him back balling this year. That usually don't happen like that. Right. He, that, that, he said thank you. That's what he meant to say. When you hurt your knee like that, you got to stay on it. During season, they don't do a lot of rehab, a lot of lifting. Your leg will get weaker. Your quad will get weaker. He's tweaked his hamstring a couple times this year. This is how I keep him getting back. You're only going to miss a game or so. Hamstring problems after an ACL, common. Common, common, common. You're going to be weaker. That leg is going to be weaker. You're asking it to do a lot more. Got to stay in the gym. Got to stay, keep your body whole. This is what we do. Even if you didn't tear your ACL, nothing tore up. This is how you keep your body whole, period. You get beat up throughout the week. Even if you didn't tear your ACL, you need to be working. But definitely, if you have injuries or anything, you got to keep the body right. You got to keep it functioning at a high level. Why work and get to this level and then fall off the cliff? You know how a season tears on you, wears on you. This is how you stay able to go deep in the playoffs. That's what Trinity does. We go deep. Mm -hmm. Hey, you Wait, see how I we say we? Done around here. You see how I say we now? I'm repping Trinity all, all day. They show me love. We like winners up in here too. Hey, y'all niggas get off the radio and get back on. Even my dog's a winner. Well, we see a lot too, guys. You know, we'll have kids come in all summer long, get big, get yoked, get shredded, get cut up, and they fall off as soon as their fall season off. starts. As soon as their season starts. And when they come back, what happens, Coach? What they happens? start off way weaker. We got to start all over. Start yep. the whole process over. Let's not do that. Let's climb. Each year we climb. Each year we climb. Yep. We have a program. It's designed to get better each year. My freshmen are going to look like freshmen. My seniors don't look like seniors, but my freshmen are going to play like sophomores, juniors. My seniors are going to play like they're college ready. Right? College ready? Keep it on. There you go, boy. Take those hips back a little bit more. Here's the most important thing. The most important thing right here is these kids trust us. They know we got their best, their best intent. Our job is to be able to help these kids that got the potential and talent get to college. Hands off after that, right? That's all I want. I'll do anything to help get these kids where they want to go. What we got left is I got to do some soft tissue on Shamar for his groin, some soft tissue work. Brandon is going to do some squats, five sets of three. We keep it light on the reps to keep his strength up. 
He's going to be ready for Friday night. We're going to go for what we're going to go. Every time I told you I want a certain number, you hit it this year. So we got to go for like 250, 300. 250, well, I'll tell you what happens in playoffs. That's where legends are born. What they gonna say about you 10 years from now? Oh man, that, that Brandon Diaz, boy, you remember that game against South Lake Cow where you went off 300? Damn dog. And they won't say nothing about me, but as long as they know, I'll be claiming credit for years. For everything. We got one of those boxes. The small ones. Yeah. Boy, get out of the way. And grab a uh, green kettlebell. Now we keep it light, we keep it light on the on the number of reps, the intensity, we stay light. We're gonna get a little heavy, but we're only gonna stay at three reps. Good squats, explosive with the hips. Drive. That's how we stay strong. That's why we carry the pile. That's why they call us pile drivers. That's why we're gonna go for 250 this week. Over 250. Of course it feels good, bro. You ready, son? You ready? You gonna squat or not? You gonna squat or not? You gonna squat or not? They, they did 25s, bro. Butt back more, bro. One more. It was supposed to be three. She was ugly as fuck. <laughs> Clearly. He probably should have kept coming, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, make, I'm just making sure the camera captures that. Oh, we are Go, big dog. Ready. We get ready to eat them South Lake Dragons. Yeah, he boys came in and got ready. his ugly ass fucking juice all over it. There you go, bring the hips, come on. Sit back and explode. There you go. Yeah, oh, he, he didn't know how much power he had, coach. He wasn't ready. He wasn't ready for all that. Bring it. There you go. Let's see if this is any better than last time. I really hope so. A little better, get a little bit deeper for me. Keep your knees wet, drive your knees out harder. This is what I've become known for my Jesus hands. I've been doing soft two shoots since day one of training. Progressively, I've gotten better. Shamar hurt his groin. First day, it was a little bit harder to get kind of the tissue to relax around it. Second day, a little harder. Yesterday, we kind of unlocked some things, which means he's able to practice a little bit harder today. The goal is to get him ready for Friday. So all I gotta do is be able to get him ready for Friday. The groin's a little bit tougher because uh, it's a little bit more intimate area. You gotta be able to trust somebody to be all up in here, huh? 
and get him ready. Relax. Y'all pick a song and leave it. Oh God. Pick a song and leave it, boy. Hendrix, where were you? 